welcome to Question of Sport, a show that has three of my favourite things, sport, quizzes and sitting down. So get yourself comfy at home and let's meet tonight's teams. Alongside Sam is a Commonwealth medal winning netballer and a footballer who won the Euros with England, everybody! <laughs> And joining Hugo is a New Zealand fast bowler with over 100 international wickets and a Grand Slam tennis champion. It's Simon Duell and Andy Lapform. Here we go. Here we go. Right, let's start the show. We're kicking off the show with the starting 11. And you go, your team are up first. Pick a number, get it right, you win a point. And your star player, which tonight is number eight, is worth two points. 60 seconds on the clock. What's your first number? Go number 11, please, Paddy. Number 11. <laughs> Jess Breach. Correct. 10, please. Daryl Mitchell. Yep. Lovely. Number nine, please. Oh, <sighs> Oh, she won the triathlon. Silver. Yes, yeah, go on. Uh, You're right with the triathlon. Double, she's got a double barrel. Um, Time's ticking. Do you want to okay, pass? Okay, we'll go to number eight, please. Star player, two points. This. Canelo. Yep. Lovely. Seven, please. Heath Davidson. Yep. Number six, please. Oh, Terry yeah, McLaurin. Tony. Yes. Five. Filao. Tony, Tony Fina. Yeah. Number four, please. Uh, oh, um, uh, Andrescu. Yeah, correct. Number three. Um, Ooh. Not, not Semi. Bravo. Uh, not Bravo. Who's that? Craig Brathwaite. No, no. Not. Go on, Simon. Oh, You've got it. You'll get it. Go on. Oh! oh. <laughs> Is that the quick bowler? Um... So the two you struggled with, number three, West Indian bowler, Kima Roach. Roach. And number nine, triathlon, you were absolutely spot on, Georgia Taylor Brown. Yeah. Okay, Trying unlucky. Barrel, Congratulations, eight points to you, goals team. <laughs> Sam, over to your team now. Same rules apply. Your star player is number six. There's a minute on the clock. Where are you going to start? Shout them out, ladies. Uh, we'll go for number one, please. Number one. Vivian Miedema. Correct. Two. Oh, oh, oh. Won the 1500. Jake Whiteman. Yes. Three. Uh, Heather, Heather Watson. Watson. Yeah. Three, nice. shall, mate. Four. Oh, not Oh, Scottish lad. Taylor. Josh yeah. Taylor. Yeah, we'll give it up. Yeah. Six. Six, John Rahm. player. Yeah. Five. Leila Guskov. Yes. Eight. Zara Phillips. Tyndall. Uh, no, no, no. Ten. Ten. Oh, Lena McGill. Yeah. Nice. Eleven. Oh, um, gosh. Gary Anderson. Yeah. Oh, go on, girl. Number nine. Stuart Broad. That's nice. Yeah. Seven. <laughs> oh, Tyreek Hill. Yeah. <laughs> The one you didn't get, Olympic gold medalist number eight, Charlotte Dujardin. Oh, wow. Oh, I tell you what, I always know when Sam's in a good mood, when she goes full scores, go on, Gail! <laughs> go on, Gail! <laughs> to the end of the round, the scores are Hugo's team are on eight, Sam's team, 11. In this next round, each of our guests will have the chance to get themselves on the podium. But which colour medal will they aim for? They have a choice of facing a one-point bronze question on their own sport, a two-point silver question on a named sport, or a three-point gold question on a mystery sport. Could be absolutely anything. Lauren, we're coming to you first. So, you've got your bronze, football, one point, darts for silver, two points, or three points... For gold, but we do not know what sport it's going to be. What do you reckon? 
You know what? I'm going to go dance. I'll go. Cool. Try it. Yeah. With a three point lead, that's I like rubbing not. salt in the wounds here. I know. Okay, I like why it. not? I like your style. That's All right, good. okay, for two points. In 2001, a player from which overseas country became the first non Englishman to contest a PDC Darts World Final? Right. How old were you in 2001, Lauren? One. Overseas what? country. <laughs> what? Kidding. What? Let's get where I'm now. Like, were you born in 2000? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I love oh. that. So, when you were one, when I was carefree, one. chilling, darts on I in the background. I was watching the darts. <laughs> oh. Kicking a football round. Yeah. You're, you, you've got something in your mind, haven't you? I have. Well, I don't know. What about, like, Michael Van Gerwen or something? Yeah. Dutch guy. Yeah. Who else? There's non English you... in there. Oh, well, so you've got you Van exactly. Gerwen. It's only the country we need. Oh, there you go then. Should we go to Holland? Go do Fancy yeah. a bit of the Netherlands? I'm going. I'm going. Oh, there you go. All right, Netherlands. Wrong. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> got a bit cruel to be kind. It's all right, we can afford Sorry, it. We've still got a lead. Yeah. Yeah. Really, it's fine. I'll, I'll, this isn't for a point, but it'll make you look clever on the tally. Any ideas? Canada. John Canada. Park. John Park, correct. Uh, well done there. Very good. You're only one. You could have doubled them two. Okay. You go see now, Andy. You're up. Let's have a look at your podium. So your bronze is tennis, your silver is Formula One, or your gold for three points and you're trailing by three points is a mystery. I think we're either going tennis or gold. Right. gold. Should we go gold? Yeah, let's do it. Go gold. On. Oh, oh yes. love it! Love it! <laughs> Fingers crossed now. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Rhythmic gymnastics. <laughs> <laughs> Mystery sport is snooker. Yes. OK, how are you on your snooker? All right. All right, OK. Since 2000, players from only three countries have reached a World Championship final on more than one occasion. England, Scotland and which other? Is it Neil Robertson? Australian. Australian. Because you watched it, you read I've it. I've watched him win one. Well, definitely. He won, he's definitely won one. OK, well... As whether well, he's played two. Yeah, back yourself. Go for it. I'm going to go for Australia, Neil Robertson. Oh, he, we go? Played it, he played in one. <sighs> Wales. Mark Williams. Mark the, Williams. The, okay. Right, girls, over to you now. And Pamela. Yes. Let's have a look at your podium. <laughs> So, obviously, we've got bronze, netball, tennis, silver, or mystery sport for three points. I think I'm going to keep it ticking over, eh? Go for bronze. I, I like your style, yeah. yeah. Let's, let's just get another point locked in. Right, yeah. Yeah. Right, OK. Who, whilst captaining her side to a ninth-place finish at the 2019 tournament in Liverpool, became the first woman to play in six World Cups? Oh, you've got this, haven't you? Bang, bang, bang. Is it, I'm thinking Blackman from... She plays for Trinidad and Tobago. Crack on. OK, I think, I think it's a Latanya Blackman. Pamela, oh. you got the country spot on. Oh! Got the name wrong. Oh, no! Rhonda John Davis. Oh, oh. no! Oh. <laughs> unlucky, unlucky. She retired, so didn't play this year at the Commonwealth Games. Oh. Right, let you back in here, you oh. go, team. Yes. Simon. Over to you now, pal. Let's have a look right. at your podium. So, obviously, we've got cricket for bronze, <laughs> athletic, <laughs> silver, I mean, or no. gold. I think get a point on the ball. Let's get a point on the ball. <laughs> we'll, just, we'll just go for a little... That's what Pamela said. Yeah. <laughs> 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 what do I know? What do I just say? Oh, yeah. Should we go cricket? All right, then. Let's go, Let's go cricket. cricket. We'll go cricket. Cricket, yeah. OK. By dismissing Hardik Pandya in last year's IPL final, who won the purple cap for the first time in his career? OK. Oh. And for those who may not know watching, tell us what the purple cap is, Simon. Well, the purple cap's the leading wicket taker yep. in the IPL. So the orange is for batting and the purple is for bowling. And you worked in the IPL, didn't you? I was on the final, I handed the cap out. <laughs> 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 oh, this is going to be worse than Pamela if I don't get it right. <laughs> <laughs> you were actually there. I was there. OK. Um, yeah. Who was on fire? Who played in the final? Josh Butler played in the final against Rajasthan Royals. 
That's uh, four Rajasthan Royals. So they played, so it's a bowler from the Rajasthan Royals. So their attack was Trent Bolt. Oh, it's got to be Chahal. Yeah. It's got to be Yuzvendra Chahal, leg right. spinner. You sold it to right. me. Yeah. Yuzvendra Chahal. 27 wickets for Rajasthan Royals. Correct. Oh, yeah. <laughs> got your point. You got your point. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been nice. <laughs> At the end of the round, the scores are Hugo's team are on nine, Sam's team, 11. <laughs> I love this next game. <laughs> You'll be using the name of the stars you see to make up a well known phrase. There are two points on offer, but if you're struggling, I can give you the category, but then you'll only get a point. OK? So, Sam, yours team of first. Have a look at this. Right, so... Right. right. First one's Bonnie Shaw. Right, Bonnie Shaw. The third one's Paige Reed. Paige Reed. Reed. Uh, ice hockey. Um, I mean, we're not going to know that one. We've just wrote Red Wings. Know. Right, that hair one. That Pony looks like tail. Me. <laughs> Is that you? I don't... It might be you. Yeah. That's why they've done the back of your head. Is that the England shirt got that little triangle at the back of the neck? Yeah. Right. So that could be. That's. I that don't think be. that's just exclusive to England shirts. <laughs> it could be. Shaw <laughs> <laughs> uh, sure something read. Ponytail or hemp? Yeah. Um, Have you got any idea? Yeah, team? we've got it. No, gen oh. Genuinely. Shawshank <laughs> Redemption. Hemp. Hempshun. Hemp. Nine. Sean. Oh, sure. Where did that come from? Yes. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Great film. Right, OK, let's just work this out. Wait, wait, sure. Friends. Something. Sh shank. Reed. Reed. Hemp. Reed. Hemp. Hemp. Nice. Sean. 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 I don't know. Where did that come from? <laughs> but thank you, well, Jesus, if it's right. Sure, shank. <laughs> that, that will be right. Sure. So he's obviously a shank. Yeah. 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 What a shank. Sure, shank. Redemption. Absolutely oh, spot yeah. on. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. What a shout. Oh. So you are That's amazing. Oh. amazing. Bunny Shaw, Daniel Shank, Paige Reed, Lauren Hemp, and Shun Ito. The... Japanese BB. What's the back of your head? That like, looks, looks a bit like me. Shaw, Shank, Reed, Hemp, Shun. Unbelievable. Oh well done unreal. there. I'll take right. it back. Okay. You yeah. goes team now. The fresh is on, boys. Unbelievable. Right. Let's have a look. Opening better for Mumbai. Ishan. Is Ishan Kishan. It's the wide receiver. Yeah. Um, so Ishan Kishan's the first guy. I should know the last guy's name and I've forgotten it. It's gone. Do you want a clue? Let's take the clue. So you're looking for something that could happen after you have an argument. Wow. Oh, oh I've got it. Kiss and make Kishan up. Kiss and make up, isn't it? Is that Super your cup. answer? Super Cup, isn't it? Yes, yeah, yeah, Super Cup. Up. Kiss and make up. Correct. <laughs> we take a point, though. Uh, uh, so, Simon... Uh, Super Cup. Simon, you were spot on. Ishan Kishan, then you had Fiona May, world champion yeah. long jumper, and then Cooper Cup, Super yeah. Bowl winner. Kishan May Cup. Love it. Brilliant. At the end of that round, the scores are Hugo's team are on 10, Sam's team 13. They've their point back. It's time to play Name the Year. Watch closely as not only we have to try and work out the year, but questions on the action will follow as well. She will leave with it all. She has the gold medal. She is the world indoor champion. Good shot. Good goal. It's United who've lit it up now. Oh, what a moment, what a moment. 
for any player to have that famous trophy, the Venus Rosewater dish. OK, first up, name the year, write it down in your tablets. You got it? We're locked in, aren't we? Yeah. yeah. Locked in? Yeah. Right, let's have a look what you've both gone for. Ooh. Ooh. 2016, 2017. You were both wrong. Yeah. Sam, you were nearest, 2018. Oh, OK, so no points there. But here's your questions. Sam's team. Wasps were winning their second consecutive Super League Grand Final against which team? Second one in 2018. Who would it likely be around that time? So it was either Loughborough Lightning or it would have been Manchester Thunder. Mm -hmm. Not Bath in the mix? No. Lightning. No, Paddy, don't give me that face. Correct! Yes! <laughs> Right, new goals team now. <laughs> Angelique Kerber was winning Wimbledon. Who is the only other German to reach the ladies' singles final since 2010? Yeah, Barty, Australian. You've got the um, Canadian. The... The one country I'm struggling. Yeah. Tennis players. Post-2010. You were only ten. Can we stop talking about how young Lauren is? <laughs> <laughs> I remember the Millennium oh, no, bringing in the Millennium. Outside of Andre Pitchford, I can't really think of a German yeah. tennis player. So you, young Lauren is. We filmed Phoenix Nights in two thousand. Did you? It's crazy, that, isn't it? I know. That's mental, isn't it? What's that? What's that? <laughs> <laughs> There's absolutely no need for that. <laughs> <laughs> That's all we've got. got on nothing it. else, have we? Yeah, you go for it, you go. go I was going to say Andrea Pickovic, but we have no idea. No. Sabine oh, Lissicki. What am I doing now? I've missed Unlock that. it. OK, Sam team, over to you. Who was scoring Man United's winning goal against Spurs in their FA Cup semi final? Oh, oh God. God. Sure, I, I didn't even write it down. I just got the score What's his name? one. <laughs> Midfielder. Was it? No, it wasn't Linderoff. It was the other fella. Looks like Linderoff. Mm. Herrera! Oh, uh, yes! Yes! <laughs> yes, <well done. laughs> yes, it was there! Yes, it was there! You brought it! You brought it! <laughs> <laughs> right, you go, team, now. Yeah. Alistair Cook was playing his final test. He finished his international career as the highest-scoring left-hander in Test cricket. Who is next on that list? Left-handers, you only got... Cook, Lara, Sanger. Let's so, take... And let's, I don't think Sanger Cara got past Lara. Let's so. just back us. Yeah. Brian Lara. Brian Lara. Yeah. <laughs> Brian Lara. Wrong. Stop it. Scored 12,400 runs for Sri Lanka. You said it, Sangakara. Unlucky. There we go. At the end of that round, the scores are Hugo's team are on 10, Sam's team, 15. Whoa! <laughs> it's time to test your organisational skills now. I'm going to show you nine options, and you must select the correct five answers. But to earn your points, you also need to get them in the right order. OK? Sam, your team are up first. And your question's on the Olympics. Oh. OK, <gasps> so there they are. Which of these countries won the most medals at the Tokyo Olympics? And we mean the most recent games, not the 1964 version. <laughs> you need to work them out and get the correct five and place them in the right order. So we've got Australia... Cuba, Japan, Hungary, India, Jamaica, Kenya, Netherlands, Norway. Kenya, Netherlands. Japan won a lot. Yeah. Can we put Japan in number one, please? Australia will be up there, I think. Australia. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. They're normally They're good at swimming. Exactly. And pretty decent, aren't they? We'll, we'll put Australia in number two for now. I feel like Jamaica might be in it, but... Maybe Sprinting. towards the end. Yeah. 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 Yeah, down the Cuba are very good at boxing. They normally clear mm -hmm. up there, yeah. don't they? I Kenya, think... again, very good at track and field, field. Yeah. on mm -hmm. the track. 
So between Kenya and Jamaica on the track, who's going to be taking home more medals? Jamaica, Jamaica then Jamaica. Sprints, yeah. Right, we'll pop in Jamaica at number three, please. OK. Go OK, on. so should we throw in Kenya next? Yeah. yeah. And then Cuba? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah? Do you yeah. see what we've got locked Let's in and play, exactly. around, play around, yeah? yeah? Okay. Right, can we check that, please? Yeah, so you're happy with that as your first choice? Yes. Yeah. Right, OK, let's see if you've got them right. Green or right? Orange are right, but in the wrong order, and red shouldn't be on there at all. Okay. Let's have a look. Oh, oh wowzers! Oh, nice. Okay, oh, yeah. so okay. you got one, two, and five, three and four uh, in the at all. Right. Okay. So so no Jamaica, no Jamaica, and no, no Kenya, Kenya, which leaves us with Hungary, India, Netherlands, and Norway. Where's your gut gone? I'm going, going a bit of Norway, aren't you? Yeah, a little bit. Lauren. Netherlands. Yeah. One hockey? Yeah, yeah. let's try that. Yeah, we'll try that because yeah. we've got another go yeah. and then hopefully yeah. process of elimination. Yeah. So who do you want to go in three? So we'll go Norway in three. Yeah. Holland in four. Yeah, and Holland in Holland four. Holland in four, okay. Can we check those, please, computer? <laughs> <laughs> let's see how you've done. Oh! Ooh. 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 Okay. Ooh. You've only got one more right. try, though. Right. right, right. So Holland is in there, so it's in three. Yeah. Yes. So, Holland in three. Can you get it right, right. at the end? So it's Last chance. In, in India. So it's India or, or, it, or, or Hungary. Hungary. Oh. oh. I think India. It's got to be India. India. Yeah. I think India, yeah. It's got to be. Yeah. India? Yeah. yeah. Let's go India in there, please. India, let's see. Oh! oh, oh no. Hungary. Hungary. Hungary, yeah. Oh. India 7, Hungary 20, but you get four points. Oh, well done there. Okay. There you go. Well done, ladies. Well done. Yeah. Yeah. Are we on your American sports over there? <laughs> OK, all right. Here's your options. Which of these franchises have made the most appearances in the Super Bowl? So we've got the Chicago Bears, uh... Denver Broncos, San Francisco 49ers, New York Jets, Los Angeles Rams, Baltimore Ravens, New Orleans Saints, Seattle Seahawks and Minnesota Vikings. So, 49ers, we can absolutely count on. Yeah. Seahawks. Seahawks, Seahawks. you can count on. Baltimore. The Ravens. 49ers have got to be one or two. San Fran, we'll put that into one. Happy? Yeah, yeah. Seahawks we're lobbing to, so they're more recent, we've put into four. Yeah. Baltimore Ravens will go three. Yeah. Go for the Bears at... Two? Put them at five. At five, five, OK. And then we just need... And then either the Saints or the Broncos. Broncos or the... Yeah, I just thought I'd have the Denver Broncos. Saints. Just going bad, I don't we'll, know. We'll put Saints in at two and we'll just have a look yeah. at... Happy okay. with that? Yeah, yeah. cool. OK. Let's see how that goes. You want to lock that in like that? Please, OK, yeah. let's have a look see how many you've got right. OK. So, you've got two right, but they're in the wrong place, and the other three, disaster. But it's, yeah. good. it's good. We've, we've eliminated three. three automatically. So we've yeah. eliminated... Won't use the word God. Seahawks. But... <laughs> so, Seahawks, God. It's all right. Pop the 49ers to two. Four to three. Seahawks, yeah. Which uh, we're now left with. LA, Jets... Vikings. We've got Minnesota Vikings. And Broncos. And Broncos. For some reason, the we Denver... Wanted, you wanted Broncos. Yeah, well, yeah. for some reason, the Denver Broncos just sort of, for me, like a, a history of a team that have... Yeah. Like, I'm going way back. Can we Broncos have the Broncos to, to one, one, please? <laughs> Broncos to one, yes, here we go. Yep. Yes. There we go. OK. Who do you want, five. four and five? Minnesota four. Right. Minnesota four, LA five. OK, so this is your second attempt. Yeah. Let's have a look. We've eliminated Fingers. three. Fingers crossed. Oh! Oh, well, it's oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. 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 <laughs> hey. Choo -choo. <laughs> Process of elimination. <laughs> <laughs> okay. You're clapping, they can still get this wrong. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen it done. So we'll have the Jets <clears throat> in. No. <laughs> so swap, uh, round five, just swap round three and five. Just swap them round, please. Okay, swap them round. Now, let's have a look. <laughs> there you go. Well done. <laughs> oh, man. 
And at the end of that round, the scores are Hugo's team are on 15, Sam's team 19. <laughs> the cold one back. One more round to see who's going to win tonight, and as always, it's going to be decided on the buzzer. It's one point for a correct answer, but get it wrong, and it's a point away. Both teams ready? Yeah. Best of luck. Off we go. Which British F1 driver's first pole position came at last year's Hungarian Grand Prix? George Russell. George. Correct. In which sport is Shelley Rudman a Winter Olympic medalist? Skeleton. Correct. Which Brazilian reached his second French Open quad doubles final in 2022? Silver. Correct. Which New Zealand spinner took a T20 hat-trick against Ireland? Michael Bracewell. Correct. <laughs> Who became world's darts champion for a second time in 2022? Peter Wright. Correct. Yes. Which Surrey Storm player was last season's netball Super League top goal scorer? Puscovia Peace. Correct. Which country hosted the 2019 FIFA Women's World Cup? France. Correct. Which rugby union team play their home matches at Franklin's Gardens? Northampton Saints. Correct. In which individual athletics event is Valerie Adams a four-time world... Discus. Wrong shot put. Oh, shot put. Which football team won the championship last season? Fulham. Too late. Oh. Too late. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Oh! And the final scores are Hugo's team are on 18, but Sam's team have smashed it tonight with 23. <laughs> That's all we've got time for tonight. A big thanks to all of our guests and the three of us will see you next time. ta -ra.